so it's still fun regardless. How much of a leadership kind of mentorship role are you, are you taking, especially with Rome and Jalen and Sawyer being just kind of freshmen from last year? Um, I feel like I have to take a big role, uh, just teaching them a little stuff about like defenses. They already they're smart guys, so they understand the offense, but just how to adjust the routes off of defenses and how to understand coverages and blitzes and whatnot. But they're still picking it up fast. Um, they're young again, but they're smart, so they're adjusting. What was it like from your perspective? Um, you know, Puka leaves and Ty leaves, Dorian leaves, Marcus leaves, Austin leaves, Jalen comes in, and, and you know, the guy coming in in the, in the summer, just what's it like watching all that, that shuffling? Um, it was actually a little devastating, I would say, because I was super close to those guys, like outside the football, but I mean, we still stay in contact, so it's not what I thought it was going to be. But um, the guys that we're getting to, like, uh, I talked to Giles and I talked to Jalen, like, when they got here, and, and they're just, they're super cool dudes, too. They're, it's just new, you know, you got to get to know them. But uh, COVID's making things pretty, pretty weird because we can't really hang out a bunch outside. But as I get to know them, like, they're pretty cool dudes. Well, it seemed like most of the receptions went to the tight ends yeah. early on. Was that situational or on purpose or what? Probably a little bit of both. I mean, we got some crazy nice tight ends, as you can see, but uh, uh, they're big targets. And today was like a red zone focus. So I would say it's a little bit more situational, but we still got some stuff dialed up for them, too. What well, does that next step to look like for you? Um, hopefully, bro. Uh, that's what I'm looking like. Uh, that's what I'm looking forward to, at least. And I mean, just trying to grind every day, but not trying to look too far ahead, trying to do what I could do every day to get better before I can get to that step. Because I feel like if you look too far ahead, uh, you start losing enjoyment of where you're at.